Caleb Patterson, Midwest Muscle, at the end of the uh, D Steve Lacey seminar for DFAC, but all competitors, all competitions, all groups, all organizations. Great seminar. People are breaking up right here. I'm here with somebody I had a chance to interview with, and she's just a gem, <laughs> and just as a person, as well as a competitor. Charla Dawson. How you doing? Did you enjoy the seminar? You, are you enjoying your time right now? I am. It's always so much fun. I'm glad to be here. It's my first time actually listening in on the DFAC stuff, so it was real exciting news. Now, you stepped on stage and you did two different, I think you did bodybuilding and figure? Yep, I did. And with, with that kind of competition, now you're stepping on, you're learning a seminar, you, you're coming to the seminar and you're learning more. How do you feel this will help you in the future? Well, I realized that figure was so much fun at the time, and then I got into the bodybuilding, and I really loved the routine. Um, and then I heard about the physique division, and then they don't call it physique, I think they call it fit body. Yes. Um, so, and I wanted to get more information about that, because the posing is different, and that's my biggest weakness, is my posing. Mm -hmm. um, so that's what I really look forward to talking about with this division, and getting back into the physique, and not quite figure bodybuilding, but sticking with just that one division now, and trying to make focus on that. Because mm -hmm. um, I've trained for so many times, I've heard this, I've heard that, and that's just where I want to be, and I think my body type fits that as well. Now, when you have judges, as well as promoters that are doing these seminars, you don't have to do guesswork, you don't have to wonder. I mean, because, you know, Lacey's one of the top judges in the, in the group, and he's very open with it. Don't ask the man a question if, you, if you're not expecting the answer. <laughs> I mean, because he's going to give you an answer. Yep, I agree with that. You know, if it wasn't for him, I would never have heard of this seminar, and uh, John and uh, Leslie as well. Mm -hmm. um, but with this DFC, I'm really excited to hear about it. I've seen, you know, Alex Ellis is huge. I follow her. Um, all the big top competitors in that, and she's told me about it before, and so thank you. And it's just growing and growing and growing. And with mm -hmm. Steven, right, you, he's always up in my grill about it. He's yeah. like, you gotta listen in. So here I am, and I'm real excited about it. So now, when, when you have like this many top names in one place, and and and, and, and like, it, it, <laughs> I'm kind of geek myself. It's like I got goosebumps just on goosebumps because you know you 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 have. You, you know, and then you have Lacey and Nellie, and then you got the House of Pain in here, and ah. then we got T. McBee. I mean, it's just so many Q. I mean, God, no, I'm like, I'm running That's out of names. Today. because I've never met all these people in one building. Like, it's yeah. been just a couple shows here and there, and then they're all here. I'm like, cool, cool, cool. This is great. And you have to ask all the questions in the world, and they will answer everything. Yeah. And it's awesome. Like, you get so much knowledge. I think I gained more knowledge in this seminar mm -hmm. than I have competing in the last four years. Now, I have been saying, you know, if there's a seminar in your area, for God's sake, go ahead and do it. Yes. Because you hate to go in with questions. Because like he was saying, if you're not presenting on stage when you're supposed to be ready, yep. and you're saying, well, I, you know, I wonder, I wonder, it makes such a difference. It does make a big difference. You know, I learned a lot about the training. I'm not saying my training was wrong, but I learned different ways of styles of training that I can incorporate. Mm -hmm. um, nutrition diet was huge today. I mean, I'm with Team Gorman, um, but I also learned other things from other people from the different um, organizations and the different um, groups of people here. You know, everyone does something different. You always yes. take something new and you're like, I should have did that. Awesome, I can try that. And it's just, exactly. The knowledge is ridiculously different. It's awesome. Now, with this many people, you would think they have their little trade secrets and this stuff, whatever. But they're open, they're honest, and they want you to improve. And, and that's got to be a blessing in itself. To be the off-season and have this many top-name competitors in one spot is a bigger blessing. And to have Lacey to bring it all together under one format. But, you know, all these different organizations are coming together and they're saying, hey, you know, this is how we can be, we can all be better. Yeah, and Stephen was like, we welcome all divisions. Come into this division. Like, he doesn't reject anything. He's like, you're more than welcome to jump in here and try it. And that's the best thing about it. Like, you don't have to be MPC or you don't have to be IPA. You can be any of them mm -hmm. and all come together. So I think it's awesome. That they're now, how do you feel where he, because, you know, the one thing that people were concerned about, especially the ones that were sending me messages, are they going to push us to do DFAC? Are they going to push us to, you know, compete in their, just their organization? I didn't hear any of that other than this is the criteria for DFAC and posing. Yep, I did not hear anything like that. Um, if you want to do something different, that's fine, but you can always, posing's not so off from the other divisions, mm -hmm. and the diet nutrition's different in all of, in different people, but he never said anything like that. He's just welcoming everyone from any organization. He does not care. He just wants everyone to come together as a whole and just learn mm -hmm. and tell your stories. Um, we learned a lot about the day. We learned a lot about people's stories today. Mm -hmm. and I think that's awesome because you never know where they started, you know, you know where they and ended. you know where they ended. That's so it's right. so cool. Now, how comfortable did you feel 
being amongst these top stars in, in natural bodybuilding? Because I mean, I'm like kind of geek. I, I got to admit, I, like it's like I want to be calm, but it's hard to be. And like for a while, I was able to maintain, but then I started getting loud and yelling. You know, my goodness. You know, I, it is nerve-wracking, and I was nervous because I've never met all these people in one building. Mm -hmm. um, and your nerves are crazy, but then when you talk to them, they're just like us talking right now. Exactly. They're normal people. They listen to you. They answer. I mean, they're, they're no different, but it is kind of scary because <laughs> they have so much experience, and it's so awesome. Um, but it's cool. Now, you had a great season, and now you're having an off-season, and now you've got a lot of stuff going on in your life that's changing. I do. You want to give people a heads up? I do. I am getting ready to get married this year. Um, I've been busy planning the crap out of it because I'm getting ready to start school next week. Mm -hmm. um, so I planned, I literally have everything booked. I did it in four weeks. Mm -hmm. Attended many bridal shows with many of my girls um, just so I can have time to myself now. Now I've got all planned. I'm starting to plan my shows now, um, getting to the cool. more routine school. Mm -hmm. It's going to take my life over. <laughs> it will take my life over. Um, but I will have stuff planned this year. Um, mm -hmm. I don't have a show just yet, um, but I can guarantee you we'll be in physique. Yes. And I will and I be back in the natural. And you'll be ready. Yes. Because and that's he, he doesn't put you on stage without that. Yes, and I'm real excited about that because I've been through many coaches, mm -hmm. um, different theories. Yes. Um, and this is probably the one I'm hoping to be the best prep yet. Because it's, it's everyday stuff. It's not just a, okay, you got to do clean stuff. I'm allowed to do the things. Just, You're you know, allowed to live. Yeah, and that's going to be the difference. So mm -hmm. I'm excited for it. So, Charla, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. It's so good to see you. <laughs> I just I'm love this girl. She's so much know? energy. I was coming down here. When I, when, I said, when I saw you on the list is going, I was like, you got to be kidding. I haven't seen her in ages. It is a fitness family. God knows. Show. Yeah, it, it is a fitness family. It and we is. do love it. It's not fake. I, I, I'm so together. yes, and it, it's such a joy. Everything. Exactly. Meet new people. So Charla, Elon Patterson, Midwest Muscle, Steve Lacey, you did your thing. All the presenters worked it. Team Gorman, thank you so much for helping out Midwest Muscle. We are out.